Welcome to our world, driven by electrical power. It's hard to find any part of our lives which does not benefit from electrical technology. It is everywhere. It's easy to take it for granted, but this electrical world is constantly in motion. It is the collective work of millions. Engineering and understanding the materials used in our electrical world is the keystone to making it all run. Advancements in materials directly leads to advancements in technology. Smaller, faster, more durable, flexible, more precise. All of these are the results of improvements in materials and design. So what are the materials that make it all work? And how do we get these materials from nature? Copper. For 10,000 years, copper has accompanied humankind on its technological journey. In the last 200 years, copper re-emerged as the most important non-structural metal, and that was due to its electrical properties. In, in modern times, we use uh, copper in many different applications, and it's because copper has a lot of really unique properties. It's the really good connectivity that it has that allows you to, to be able to use it for all these electrical things. Well, copper uh, globally is, is an indispensable uh, metal and almost a, a benchmark for the advancement of world economies and development, if you will. So where do we use copper and why? So here we have four everyday items that you probably recognize. They all contain copper. Now copper has four major uses in our electrical world. And in order to take a look at those four uses, we're gonna have to take a look inside. Here we have a circuit board. And on the circuit board are integrated circuits. Integrated circuits are considered the brains of modern technology. Copper is also used in wireless technology to send and receive messages ranging from your personal phone calls to national defense. This is copper wire. Copper wire is used as a pathway to transmit power into your home, school, or business. But it can also be used on a microscopic scale in electronics. This is a transformer. A transformer contains an electromagnet, which is the fourth use of copper. Electromagnets are used to generate power, transform power, or convert power back into motion. So it's great that we know all this, but that's not the whole story. So how does copper go from this to this? Let's find out.